So I couldn't tell her that. And after a point of time, I was really worried because I had a show in a couple of hours. I've never faced this situation before. And, and I needed some PR advice. And I want to reach out to a fellow comedian to ask, what would you do if you, do you cancel a show? What do you tell the people, et cetera, et cetera. But all of my friends in India were sleeping due to time zone issues, right? So the only comedian who was available and who was also a good friend of mine, who, who happened to be touring United States of America around the same time that I was there, was Biswa Kalyanrath. You guys know Biswa Kalyanrath? <laughs> So Biswa is like a great comedian and a very good friend. And I reached out to him seeking advice on what to do in a situation. But I forgot one thing, which is that before being a friend, he's a great comedian. And here is something that you need to understand about comedians, which is that it's very hard to be funny and also be a nice person at the same time. <laughs> Only Alex can do that, okay? <laughs> because for you to be funny, fundamentally, you have to be a truth. And Biswa is one of the funniest guys in our country. <laughs> so you can imagine how big a truth he is, okay? <laughs> but I forgot, I reached out to him as a friend. So I was like, Macha, I'm stuck in the airport, I have a show in a couple of hours, I don't know what to do. Macha, give me advice, what do you do in this? And he was like, oh my God, dude, this is just like how it happens in those flight documentaries. I was like, what flight documentaries? Oh, have you not seen those flight documentaries where there are a lot of drama happens before the flight taking off, there's a lot of crisis in the airport, and then finally, the flight takes off. I'm like, okay, that's a good thing only, no. He's like, no, then it crashes. <laughs> Here's another thing you should realize about us, which is that as comedians, we like to give as much as we get. So when you give us a gift like this, we would like to spread it to the universe. So when Biswa told me this, immediately I thought of those two old white ladies next to me. I started making conversation with them. And, and she was like, oh, you're a comedian. I was like, yes, I am. Oh, when's your show? Oh, in a couple of hours. Oh my God, are you going to make it on time? Well, I don't know. I've been asking my friend in Chicago about it. And he just sent me a couple of messages. Oh, uh, what, what's he saying? I don't know. Why don't you read it yourself? I don't understand. <laughs> And then she took the phone, she read the message, and it finished by saying, and then the flight crashes. <laughs> and then she was like, what was your name again? <laughs> and I was like, Inzamam Ulhaq. <laughs>